many people, uh, especially if you are uh, a bit late in badminton, start like holding the rack like this, and when they are up here, they are very, very bent up here in, in their hand, and it actually looks quite like a scorpion. So I call it scorpion technique. And you don't want to do that, because when you do the scorpion technique, then you're going to do this kind of whiplash with your wrist when trying to hit this shot. So you don't want to do this wrist shot, but you want to, to rotate in your forearm when trying to do the shot. When you're rotating, you also have much more variations and you're able to do different things when playing. But be aware of this scorpion tick. So not like this. But like this. Sometimes the shuttle is coming over your head and just before you're going to hit the shuttle, your uh, ragged arm drops and do like this. So if you can imagine how your, your spine is built up with all of these layers all the way down, the bottom will kind of be uh, squeezed together and it's actually quite demanding for a spine to keep uh, that pressure. So for example, if you are on the back here and then you go down like this, you can kind of imagine how it looks like in this side of your spine, how it will actually be squeezed together. So you want not your uh, right arm to drop like this before you hit, but you want it to stay up tight. Kind of feel like you're pushing your, your ribs out and your chin, put it a bit up so you're out here. Um, uh, and creating a lot of space for yourself. And not down here, because it is a, 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 a your posture around your back is going to be uh, uh, wrong and it's quite demanding for your back and that's also why some people tend to get uh, uh, back pain and that's actually because when they're doing overhead shots it's a wrong technique. So you want to be up here and not like this. And if I show the first one it will be something like this, going down and hitting what you want to do is obviously arm up here, hit it like that. That's where we get some power and we also get much more height on our shots. So we are not going to do this W or double Y when, when hitting. Some players, it's, 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 when it comes falls down our head, we do like this. It's very, very narrow. Uh, the angles here is all too sharp to, to be able to, to do something. Yes, again, get out, create some space for yourself. Again, put out your ribs and put out your chin. So really out here and being able to, to take some space for yourself when doing this. It also helps your swing. So your swing will be much bigger and much more able to create some, some power. But in here, it will be much more I don't know what, what this is, but you don't get so much power, but at least you look stupid. So make the other thing work for you and not this narrow thing, but get out here and take some space. That is also why some people lose a lot of energy when hitting their shots. Not like this, but much more like this.